Well, this is looking back into the village from St. Mary's Church. So we're quite high up here. There's such lovely people here. Absolutely lovely. It's a real quaint, typically Suffolk village. Well worth a visit. Well hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, this week I'm looking at, which is rather unusual for me, uh, painting a acrylic. Um, and this is Kersey, uh, uh, more or less North Essex here in the UK. And I decided to paint a an acrylic purely because um, I do occasionally paint acrylics and uh, because I've never I've not painted a, acrylic for a while I just fancied painting buildings um, sitting in this lovely street um, it's a lovely quaint little village there's a ford that runs through at the bottom of the village we've got a church up here on the right and uh, these lovely old cottages uh, and a street that turns and goes up hill and um, so I really enjoyed painting this one and I'd like to lead you through the painting process that I use to paint acrylics. Now basically the composition is pretty easy really. Uh, sky, um, buildings um, and uh, distant trees. Um, we have a couple of cars, a couple of figures and um, a pond. I've actually put in um, four ducks which are just crossing the road that you see very often um, in that little village um, a bit of hedging holding the left in and the idea behind this and it, it, the sun was at that angle that these buildings would be in shadow casting a shadow onto the road but these buildings would all be in sunlight so that was really the thinking behind the process so I had to keep um, I wanted a fairly dark area in the distance I wanted a light greenery at the top to actually um, give that feeling that the sun was shining obviously a blue sky simply treated because it's a very small part of the picture so it only needs to be simply treated um, these roof areas are pretty much light because they're in sunlight the sun is fairly high um, these are also light but the buildings go around the corner so that one's a bit lighter than that one but these I turn away from the light so those are in shadow um, so when you when you're looking at a subject like this it's all about shadows really when you're looking at buildings um, and well it is any landscape really um, and consequently I had to get this area these were all white um, uh, render um, this was a couple a couple of pink sort of like a, a, a an orangey pink uh, rendering on that one and this one was white but of course you know when, when you get sunlight on buildings um, the actual um, rendering uh, and the reflections you get from other buildings change the light of that rendering it's basically still the same but you can get a warm a cream a cool cream um, a, a, you know a, a red cream a yellowy cream a green cream um, all depending on on white depend on the light of the day and so with the sun on there we we I need to pick out the sun um, the features are very loosely painted I tried to paint fairly quickly but the video I think will be about an hour long um, but um, I think it came off particularly well and of course the shadows in the foreground make all the difference um, uh, the water was treated simply purely because uh, it was all about the building so a simple sky a simple uh, treatment of the trees and a simple treatment of the road and the water but of course the interest is the buildings themselves so there you have it and if you would like to um, um, 
see how I painted this, then tune into my YouTube channel, 6 p.m. UK time, this coming Friday, and uh, I'll lead you through the complete the complete painting process. So we hope to see you all then. Well, it's been a number of years since I've visited Kersey, and uh, obviously uh, somebody's waving at the window. We don't know them, but they're certainly enjoying themselves. There's such lovely people here, absolutely lovely. It's a real quaint, typically Suffolk village. Well worth a visit.